Hey everybody, Tim on here. How's everybody doing? Tonight we've got another NECA unboxing for you and this one is a beauty. We're opening this. Nightmare on Elm Street Part 2, Freddy's Revenge. One of my personal favourite films. Recently acquired from the wonderful people at Mad About Horror. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, here we have Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge. Look at that artwork, that is superb absolutely superb obviously from the poster so so well done look at that so oh, it's brilliant look at that artwork nothing like jesse nothing at all and why is there i mean is that supposed to be the bird is that supposed to be the no i don't know is that supposed to be the bird that's in the cage oh i have no idea man of your dreams is back i love that artwork the fact that they are doing the poster art for the front of these boxes is the another reason why i literally am buying these because they're just so damn good side Nightmare on Street 2 freddy's revenge love the logo oh i just noticed look what's there look it's the bus on the cliff at the beginning and the end oh i love it absolutely love it same on this side oh same on that side so good back cover here we go Nightmare on Elm Street 2 uh, in the bus look at that that's good we'll get into the, the actual specifics but there you go includes two team two demon dogs magnetic attachable fire effect removable hat and interchangeable heads and hands yes it does so let's have a look at it steady now oh yes let's get onto the picture first look at that from that classic scene Yes, love it. Get it closer. Look how good that looks. That's so good. Let's put it there so you can see it properly. They haven't got the best light in here, so you'll have to bear with me. But you get the demon dogs. Look at that. I can see why the box is so big because you've got Freddy with his arms out, plus you've got the demon dogs, terror dogs. Terror dogs, Ghostbusters, demon dogs. Click on them on the back. Demon dogs, isn't it? Demon dogs, yeah. Way bigger than your standard freddy because there's your standard freddy there look at that it's a good inch it's a good inch uh, wider same same width on top i'm not going to move the camera but yeah you've got at least a good another good inch must be because of the um the dogs and freddy's arms it's got to be shame because uh, they look so neat they're all the same i don't know why this you know but that that's how it is anyway that's it in the box Let's get it out of the box. Background. It's the pool party scene. How good is that? I never really, you couldn't really tell inside the box what it was, but it's the pool party scene. Great when you get them all together and you put them in. Like last time, quality card, nice and thick. Good, good. That's what we want. Right, let's have a look at him himself. Okay. There he is. Now let's have a let's pull it back a bit so we can get a proper look at him. Let's have a look see. Here we go. Wow, look at that detail on the face. Another one, another brilliant detail on the face. Look at that, see if we can get it close as we can get it. That's superb, that is. Look at that. Nice burnt effect going on there. Let's have a look at that. Oh, look at that. It's the uh, coming out the finger, the razor fingers, as they, I'm sure it's mentioned in the film. I can't remember exactly. Look at that. That is that is superb. Another uh, cloth. Not have a cloth. What mind about another uh, rubber top? But that is superb. Oh, look at that. Look at his legs. The boots. Oh, that is something else. One of my favourite Freddies, to be honest, because it looks. In the film, especially, he looks quite evil. Bit of a turn on his head there, pretty good. Arms can go down, arms around, the usual sort of twisty motion, stuff like that. Oh, that's brilliant! Look at that. Let's get some. Uh, let's get some accessories. Okay, fedora again. Probably similar to the last one, but let's try it just to make sure. Because it's. Ooh, creaky creaky oh ooh, oof, ho, ho, ho. that looks the 
bee's knees, my friends. That looks the that looks bee. Ah, superb. Look at that. What else we got? Okay, let's put you back there a little bit, my friend. Okay, extras. We have the other head. That's superb. It even has the. You've got the body. I've got the brain. scene in it as well superb look at that very reminiscent of uh, nightmare 3 actually that you know when the uh the, the snake <coughs> excuse me woo but yeah that is superb the, the detail on that is great and that the brain thing class absolutely superb that is that's good okay what other whilst we got here we go next one oh now that is the face of, of freddy 2 way more he's got like the indented face he's a bit more evil that's like when he's hissing at the pool party isn't it you know when they shoot the uh, the dad comes out with a shotgun and shoots him are his eyes red because in the film they give him red contacts i can't tell here let me just have a look close up they may be i can't really tell it's such small detail if it isn't then Necker, you have failed and you have to go back to the drawing board. If they are, and I just can't tell, then Necker, carry on taking all my money. That's a nice way. That's nice. Both of those extra heads are really cool. Look at them. Superb. Can you even see his eyes in that one? Yeah, very faint. They are there, but very faint. They are very cool. Look at those. Very good. Okay. Okay, before we get into the dogs, I'd like to show the proper glove. That's really cool. Look at the detail. Look at the detail on the glove. That's superb. Interchangeable, obviously, if you want to go old school. That's well smart. Love it. Love it. I will stick with the uh, the classic hand because that is basically how I remember part two. Proper nasty. Should we try and change the um, change the head for the, the head I like? Let's give it a go. Now, I know for a fact this is, can be quite tricky getting these on. They're not the easiest, but we'll... Oh, you've got to give it some welly. Jesus. Bear with. Oh, I think you need a degree in science to get that on there. Now that. <laughs> that. That. With his arms out. That is great. Look at that. I, mean, I can't really get it. I can't do it justice on the, on the camera here. But that is really something. That is definitely the best head to use. I think personally. But interchangeable. So you can have what you want. Oh, it's so good. Just is a little bit drunk. That's all. Doesn't want to stand up. That's so good. Obviously, I'm sticking with that glove. Because I think it's great. Okay, put you back there. Last couple of accessories. You were a little, proper little drunk one tonight, aren't you? Woo! Too many, uh, too many demon shandies. I think you have in there, mate, aren't you? Stay still. There you go. Okay. Now these are weird. Look at that demon dog. Detail on them is great. My only gripe with it is, do they turn their heads turn as well? My only gripe with these things are. They're in the film for like a couple of seconds and they're not super <laughs> memorable. They're a bit like, oh, there's a kid's face on a dog. Right, okay. So to have them as a giant accessory to this seems a little excessive. But it's still they're still well done. There's the other one. Oh, lovely. Look at you. You look lovely. Yeah, nicely done. Nicely made, you know, same swizzle head motion going on. Nicely done. I just don't think it's... Is it needed? Ah, well, it's good for good for item, but if, if I'm going to display this one, I'm probably just going to have him with the fire, probably. These, they're good, but they, they wouldn't go on it. They wouldn't really go on a shelf, but anyway, yeah. Cool. 
nonetheless this one's a bit drunk what's going on with this leg here Woo, he's got a little bit i got a proper little drunk figure tonight don't want to stand up but i've way too many beers now last accessory i want to talk about is the fire now this is a cool item the classic scene in the pool you're all my children now you all know it there's the fire look at the detail on the fire that's really good and what i love about this is right you can go out of the way boys or girls god knows what you were there we go you turn your freddy round he magnetizes to the back so when you flip him round and you do the classic scene with the peel not that, that the background makes much difference but you're all my children now seeing that is superb look at that that's great that really is great you need to sort of have that out like that really to get full full appreciation of it great for taking pictures that ladies and gents necker they they really they do some cracking detail on the on these figures they really do i was so reluctant to, to collect them just because of the the, the cost and things like that but you know what these are 30 pound each what you're getting for 30 quid is absolutely superb that you know that's brilliant whoever thought of that is a great it's a great idea it really is now the ultimate test do me favorite thing put me favorite background behind it because that's how they'll be displayed beautiful great great figure so glad i got part two now we just need part three <laughs> won't be long so there you go people there's me unboxing for you hope you enjoyed it we have other necker videos up on the old channel have a look see what you think and until next time stay safe stay tuned stay sick tim man out